Hello folks, this is the Romaine Casual, back again, this time with an episode for Undermine. Uh, Undermine is a roguelike, um, sort of like Binding of Isaac, um, but a little bit different. Um, I originally played during Early Access, so this is sort of a second impressions, I suppose. I haven't played in a while, but I'll go ahead and start off. Peasant, I have an important task for you. As you've noticed, this mine is plagued with terrible earthquakes. I need you to delve into the mine and find the source of the tremors. And there's another thing. Our blacksmith has gone missing, and without him the forge lies dormant. If we are to delve deep into the undermine, we will need someone to forge new equipment. Find the blacksmith and the source of the tremors. Now off with you, peasant. Take this key and unlock the entry to the mine. Do not fail me. Okay. Wait, peasant, take that journal on the table. All right. Keep the journal with you. Refer to it if you ever seek an answer to a question. Let's hit the sparkles. Here we go. Right. Gold mine one. Press A to jump. Jumping dodges attacks. X to attack. I figured that out already, thank you. for bombs. Okay. Alright. Let's unlock the door. Beware of pilfers. They are thieves. I mean, is it really being a thief to steal something that was just laying on the ground? Alright, I don't see anything back here. And an item. Bottled lightning. Chance on hit to chain lightning. That sounds useful. Good luck, peasant. I take it the wizard set those signs up. look like rocks. Can we blow them up? No. Alright, so we'll we'll just leave those. Um, it looks like there's an item in there, but we don't have a key. A bit more gold. This so will go this way. Oh! I dropped food. And there's a chest, but again, I don't have any keys. So 
Sounds of sparkles up here. Alright, I don't see anybody on the walls. Guess there's nothing I can do there. South it is. I'm not sure if those mushrooms can actually hurt me or not. Okay. Oh, hi there, friend. Name is Wayland, and I'm the blacksmith. Oh, good. I was just down here picking some mushrooms when one of those quakes caved the entrance in. It's cool. I got a prescription from the apothecary for these. Okay. Appreciate you blasting me out of here. Drop by my forge if you find yourself up top. I'll kit you out in all the best gear. I can also craft any blueprints you find laying around. You may even find one in that chest over there. Free of charge. See you soon, pal. Alright. Off he goes. By the way, if you can afford it, I suggest buying that pickaxe on the rack over there. Did a fine job on that one. See you soon. So wait, you, like, you're charging me for it? That just seems wrong. Okay, we got Wayland's boots. Alright, so do we not need keys for those chests? They surely look like they have keys. Well, I mean, I can't get to that one anyway, but... No, apparently not. Cool. No! We have a bomb now, though. Try that. Oh, we've been cursed. Drop gold continuously. Alright, so let's see. Can we see... Items become extra fragile. I have no idea what that means. Stop! Stop! <laughs> Alright. Well, I got some money out of that. But I still don't have a key, which is a problem. It means I can't go to the item room. And there is another room down here. Oh, it's a shop! And they have a key! Alright, grab that. A pocket grill cooks all your food. I don't have that kind of money, so... Off we go. There's apparently no, no money there. Oh, there is money here, though. Alright, take our key to the item room. Phantasmal axe. Thrown pickaxes duplicate themselves. I assume it has to hit something to duplicate itself, and that's why we can't see it doing anything. Alright, I have 
to remember to throw it at something on the next level. I guess that's what they mean by duplicate. Alright. At least they seem to be homing. Offer. No, no, I want both of those. I don't know what that does. Alright. Looks like we have a quest area. Don't bother, it's locked tight. I let that wizard bamboozle me into coming down here and look what it got me. If you help me out of here, I'll, I can help you out too. I have some useful skills being a bombsmith and all. Hmm. Meal ticket. Free food at the shop. Right now. Okay. Anything? Nope. Ha! Sparkles mean blow things up. Got it. Alright, so this is a locked chest. So the locked ones look different from the non locked ones. And there's some food! I do like how the pilfers have cute little Santa hats. That's adorable. Alright. I don't see anything. Ah! There's a secret room down there. Ouch.
lucky. A mediocre ring. Popcorn. Hmm, no pilfers. Interesting. So what's in the secret room? Oh, it's a room we'd already been to. All right, I guess we should go release the prisoner. I'm headed back up top. Don't trust that wizard, but got nowhere else to go. Make sure you pay me a visit. I can upgrade those firecrackers you call bombs. Okay. Jump, jump, jump. Some money. Another bomb. And another store. Cosmic Egg. Increase experience gain for a familiar. Hmm. Food seems important. Sure. Let's level up the bird faster. And grab a key. Sure. Now I have no money, but... Well, not no money, I guess, but close to it. And the bird leveled up. So what does that mean? Uh, the canary picks up gold for the peasant. Gold picked up by the canary and the peasant is increased in value. The canary gains speed and can steal gold from pilfers. Okay. There's a path up here. Ah. Spider. Uh oh. Health could certainly be doing better. Oh, we still get free food at the shop. That's nice. Sale. Ah, oh, the holy water is on sale. And it would remove our curse. But I honestly don't think our curse is our biggest problem right now. on air. <clears throat> I guess that means we don't fall down anymore, like I just did a little bit ago. Huh. There we go. Let's see what's this way. Sir, I'm going to have to ask, kindly ask you to turn around. This dungeon is off limits. Alright, I guess we can't go in there yet. So it looks like there's no way to get in there without having to hit the spikes at some point. There we go. There we go. Saved by jumping. Okay, so we'll head up here and this way. Ah. Alright, got that. 
look like there's anything else. Food. No! Alright, got both of those. I guess we have to beat up this guy. that's supposed to do. I don't know. It made a sad noise, so I probably just wasted a key, would be my guess. Alright, get that. And then there's a skull up here. Signs don't say anything. This has bad idea written all over it. Now it has even more bad idea written all over it. Ah! Mean! There's the blacksmith. Get in here, peasant. Okay. Peasant, you've returned! Oh, someone new. Very well. Peasant, I have gathered some special items that may help you in the undermine. Feel free to use the gold you mine to pay for them. They will, of course, remain company property. Do not fret, though. Your canary will ensure they are passed on in case you meet your end. Thanks. That, that makes me feel a lot better. What's this? Oh! Changes your appearance. Okay. 
Keep the names and health of your enemies. Well, before I go spending money on these, something tells me that the blacksmith and the bombsmith also want to sell me things. Well, hey, it's my bud! You a bit taller now? I mean, you're definitely not as colorful. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for giving me a hand out of that cave. I've cleaned up the forge and have some new wares on display. Check them out! All the finest quality, I promise. If you buy something, I'll supply it to you and all your buds. You know, in case you... Well, you know. Also, I can craft relics. If you come across any blueprints in the mines, bring them my way. Alright, so it looks like... I can afford the gloves. Or the shirt. And that's about it. Uh, craft. So he can make boots for us. They cost eight. And they break spikes. We don't have enough for the popcorn. Uh, we do have enough for the ring, which would increase health and damage. Um, sure. Let's grab the ring. And the gloves. And the bombs, sure. Well, the bomb damage, anyway. Alright, take two. You know we can't blow those up. Hmm. Looks like there's a room over here. Oh boy, look at you. Your hat is so on point. I am Black Rabbit, the adorable, mother of critters, queen of the tavern, and destroyer of hot cross buds. Okay. Heads up, though, fashionable one. Someone took out a rock pile mimic around here, and ever since, well, bad things have been making their way up from the depths, which is why you need this. What do you say? Blueprints don't normally come this cheap. For you, my friend, the family discount. Sure. The lucky charm. Ah, the doofus bought it! A useless scrap of paper! I'll make a fortune off these suckers! <laughs> Oops, I said the quiet part out loud again. <laughs> what I meant to say is thank you for your patronage. I hope to do business with you again soon. <laughs> Have a wonderful day. Alright. actually hurt yet. And we've got a potion. Ah! Alright, looks like there's an item room down this way. Golden popcorn. Gold will sometimes duplicate itself. Don't see anything else in here. Uh, 
Oh, a ham. That was good. Spend one bomb and get three. That makes sense. Increase critical chance. Drop a random chest. Actually, let's just grab this and... There we go. Although I don't have a key, so that's not going to do me any good. Looks like that's it. Next level. Missed. Ah, fire. key. Oh, hello, human servant. Perhaps you can help me. Baba has sent me below in search of three particular mushrooms. They are nothing like these pathetic ordinary mushrooms. They are unique, with special qualities. I'm not allowed to return until I find them. Baba has no sympathy for my condition. If you happen upon these mushrooms, will you bring them to me so that I can leave this dank and dreary cavern? For mushrooms. Oh wait, no, there's gold. Okay, now we're looking for mushrooms. And a key, still. Ouch! Okay... Shop is this way. Did they have anything? They have a key! And also some food. Okay. This way. Choose. That... Ah, here we go. Shrapnel. Friendly bomb blasts fire projectiles. And... Conductor. Electrify your enemies when you pick up gold. And both of them have two purple flaming skulls, which I'm guessing are some kind of... Maybe they're curses? Ouch. Definitely curses. And pilfers don't seem to count as enemies. Good to know. So what curses do we just pick up? Reduced maximum health and deal less throw damage. Good. Good. I didn't need either of those things. How good my aim is. Bad. The answer is bad. At least we got some more food from that. Try to stay. 
stay out of the fire. We're electrifying them, but it doesn't seem to be doing us a lot of good. I'm just going to put a bomb over here and then head this way. Hopefully avoid the flames. Ah! Whenever you're done. Thank you. jump surprisingly far. And I still don't have a key. So I guess we're moving on. No item room for us. Ow. Looks like the path down. So let's explore a little bit more, see if we can't find a key or two. Can I not go through? Oh, I can. Okay. imagine any situation where dropping bombs continuously would be a thing that didn't end in me dying. Sparkles! Mom! There we go. There's another potion. Temporarily increase health. Eh, that's not really what I need. I don't see anything else interesting in here. Nope. Back we go. Also a room this way though. I'd gotten off of the track. Oh well. Alright, so that's our first two runs of Undermine. It didn't take too long. Um, and we'll probably continue this one later because this one is a lot of fun. But I hope you've enjoyed this video and I will see you next time.